very excited. I thought uh, tonight came out without a hitch. Uh, just beautiful girls, great venue, and beautiful hair, sexy hair. And I think that's what it's all about, is sexy hair. I think we kind of got away from sexy hair for a long time, and it was just more ratty and chopped up hair, and I think the elegance of hair has kind of gone away. I, th I think of the economy was a big part of it and I think a lot of people started doing their hair their own doing themselves and buying box hair color and and snipping their their fringes themselves and uh, I think we're we're moving out of that and I think people want to start feeling good about themselves and what better place by changing their hair you know putting it up getting a new haircut getting a new color and just constantly changing because hair is an accessory and it's your best accessory I actually grew up in it. My father's a hairstylist, my sister's a hairstylist, and uh, I went to Vidal Sassoon and I trained out of Sassoon. And that's where I really learned how to cut and learned the discipline of cutting hair. I wanted to push it a little bit, get a little edgy, but it still had to be pretty at the same time. And I, I kind of wanted to show the people that were here tonight that they could still dress up their hair and maybe think it's something a little different than taking a flat iron and just walking out with straight hair when they go out to uh, parties or out with their friends. I normally wear my hair pinned straight and down, so this was a huge transformation for me. I feel like a diva, and it's all thanks to Nick. He's amazing, and I really do feel great with this hair. I feel like it commands attention when I walk in the room. It's definitely a hairstyle that you can wear going out, going out to work, a nightclub, um, going to the mall. It's really just an, an all-do hairstyle, which I absolutely love. Nick did a great job with it. A little messy, not like dirty, but you know, a little messy, like, you know, kind of just walk out of bed and you do your hair up and yeah, it's definitely, messy is in. Dress is amazing, I love it. It's by Harrison Heritage and the jewelry is by Obsession. It's a beautiful necklace. It's very sophisticated. I would definitely wear it going out to a nice dinner, any special event, or even going to work. Well, actually, I always have my hair down. It comes to like about here, just straight. Um, I never wear it up because I don't actually know how to get it this perfect when it's up. Um, I can't even get it to a high bun like this. It doesn't look good. Yeah, it's, it's cool. It's a different look. I usually don't actually rock anything like this, so it's, it's pretty good. This is totally new for me. I haven't worn my hair crimped since I've been in like high school. And it's definitely an amazing look. Nick did a great job on my hair and I absolutely love it. This is a complete look that I would totally rock if I was going out, to a concert, nightclub, anything. I think it's very trendy. I think it's very glam rock. Um, I feel like a Rolling Stone. It's all my hair. He teased it. Nick did a great job. I, w I would totally wear this normally out to a club or, you know, just a night out around town. I would totally wear it. I love the necklace. I love the dress. Alice and Olivia is one of my favorite designers. It's a dress that you can wear to a party, to a wedding, for a date, out with your friends, or anywhere really. You can even wear it to work with a blazer. It's a great look. The hair is great. I love accessories. I love jewelry. Obsession makes great accessories. And they look very nice with the hair. The hair is very romantic. And um, they're very classic. Glam up their look. I think something what we did today was like was that simple, easy bun. Just takes a rubber band and a bobby pin and just twist it up and get yourself a whole new look. See your local hairdresser and get fringes. Fringes are big right now, so that will just change your whole haircut. You can still keep it nice and long and just change up the front. I was one of the makeup artists for Nick's team. Basically, we wanted to keep them very um, natural, fresh, um, very pretty, uh, but we also wanted to reflect the clothing, clothing that they were wearing. So I went with a little bit of a modern um, look with a little bit of an edge. Whenever it's uh, something for fashion, you really want to dig in a little bit, make it a little bit more creative rather than just every day. I was always an oil painter, very creative, and um, I just use people as my, uh, my canvas. Anybody, woman, man, if they're having a bad day, if they go to their local hair salon, get their head massaged, get a treatment, get their hair blown out, or just even a little snip of a haircut, they always feel better when they walk out of a salon, and that's how it should be.